Hey guys, it's your boy D Blitz here with another game plan. Today we're playing some more State of Decay 2. We're picking up right from where we left off. I switched from Levy to this guy, but I had a legacy uh, mission come up. But right now, Levy is completely exhausted. So I think I'm going to use this guy to go talk to uh, these doctors right here. Uh, and talk to them about some oh, medical man, supplies. I'm done with you pushing people around. Okay, now I'm definitely gonna kill you. Well, I drive by the scattered survivors because I was coming to check on them, and they want to kill me. So, with that being said, I guess we're gonna kill some survivors that I don't like killing in the first place. Are you kidding me? Fire in the hole. There, leave me alone. Back on. There we go. I tracked some zombies over there. Oh, that's sad. They're having to bury people of their own community. One of them tried to get out. One of them still has their feet sticking out. Oh, that's sad. That is sad. Yep, not taking a chance of you getting a little zombie. Huh. Is it just one of you? Oh, there's only one of you? Well now I don't feel so threatened. Here, let's set everybody on fire. I'm tired of watching this guy roll around. Huh. Goodbye, sir. Too easy. We just showed everyone else in town that we don't take shit from anyone. Yeah, I don't like killing humans. I'd rather recruit them, but sometimes it gives us a hard choice to take them out or to not. Well, I guess now let's go check out uh, what these doctors have to say. Hi, Mana. Oh yeah, there was uh, survivors here before. And then I recruited uh, one of them to our town, and then they just dispersed. Thank you. So you want me to help you get some meds? Where am I traveling to? Why the crap over there? Oh, okay, no, no, right here. I was about to say that's too far just to find this lady some meds. She's not coming with me, I guess I'm doing this on my own. Hopefully my vehicle holds out. I have some news to share. Ooh. I think that is that wandering trader that I've been looking for. Because normally if it says they have really good stuff to trade, there's a reason why. But we'll have to go check him out after we get this lady some medical supplies. What did I hit? I didn't even hit anything. Goodness. These vehicles are so frail. Yeah, let's close this door because I know there are zombies right behind me. Why would there be medical supplies in a garage? On before they all they got through. Crap. Come on. Take both of you on. All three of you on. Come on. Oh, that's what I thought. That is what I thought. Whoever lost this don't need it now. That's what's up. Well, we found some uh, building materials and some medical supplies. Keep it coming. All right, so let's uh, let's go give uh, 
this rucksack to this dear old lady. Oh my goodness. My car's gonna end up blowing up. I'm gonna just hit a blade of grass and it's gonna blow up. But well, we were back at the homestead, luckily. My vehicle did not blow up. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this and with the rest of the supplies. And then I'm probably gonna go ahead and switch to Levy, even though he's probably not fully rested. Oh, it looks like he is. Once you complete this mission, you'll never be able to access this community again. However, completing this legacy gives you perfect ability. So it just said I will not be able to access this community again once I do this final mission. So I think this is the point where I need to choose what I'm gonna take and who I'm gonna take. So I think I'm gonna access community. Uh, I know I'm taking Levy. I think I'm gonna take Katherine. Uh, let's see what she looks like. Uh, yes, she's got the extra pocket in her inventory. So what I'm gonna do is load Katherine here with what I need. Uh, Katherine, I think she's gonna carry all of my guns. So what I'm gonna do is come down here to my guns and I'm gonna pick as many guns as she can carry are the, is what uh, I'm gonna take. So I think I'm gonna scavenge majority of every single one of my uh, melee weapons. I think I might keep a couple of them, but that's probably gonna be about it. Uh, I know I'm taking the Gangland Strat. I'm taking the Stormbringer. That's almost as much as I can carry. I'm gonna take the uh, Peppers AK. Uh, actually thinking about it, considering, uh, and then I'll put the long slide with her and Hunter's revolver. So I'm gonna put about five or six guns on each person just because of a uh, weight, just specifically for weight. But, and then I'm gonna probably load them down. I'll load this girl down with some melee weapons. Uh, let's see, what else do I need to bring? Uh, let's bring some strong painkillers and we'll bring medicine and and mechanics just get a couple extra books and this girl is ready to go all right so we have Katherine Levy and then who's going to be our next? So she has mutations, which is chemistry, I believe. Construction. Let's take control of this guy and see. Uh, he's got a lot of health. Oh, crap. He's got a lot of health, and he's a construction person. So I think I'm going to take this guy. So let's uh, drop that off. We'll salvage this, drop that off, drop that off, drop the painkillers off. So I'm probably going to put the shots of espresso with this guy, uh, some more strong painkillers. Let's see, what else? Uh... I'm going to add the, let's see here, I'm probably going to add some facility mods to this guy, because what's something that I'm going to need? I'm going to need probably this signal antenna, uh, the heavy duty ammo press, a lot to carry and this guy's already freaking 
up there as far as weight. I'm sure you're on top of it, bro. I'll take Have both of those. They are high trading values. So I'll take those. Um And then I'm gonna load up a crap ton of ammo with this guy. Take a bunch of those, 45 calibers, uh, nine millimeter, and then a shot. Uh, I'll take the 762 ammo, cause those are the most common. And then I'm also gonna give this guy and uh, the girl each rucksacks, different rucksacks a piece. Okay, so she's already traveling traveling heavy. So I kinda wanna be careful, but I think I'm gonna give her ammo. Let's see here, yeah, I'll give her ammo. And then I'll give Levy gas. So now let's, uh, she's ready to go. Let's look at our community. All right, time to be Levy. And Let's take control of Levy, yes. Yo, on it. Alright. So let's look at our locker stuff. I'm honestly... I'll equip this. And I'm gonna salvage absolutely everything possible. And then I'm gonna take all the uh, parts with me. So that way... I have as many parts as possible. Alrighty. I believe I believe I have everything that I'm gonna want to take. All my people are completely geared up, but I think I'm ready to go. Let's go. <laughs> Uh oh, why'd you briefly chuckle? You better go talk to. Uh... See ya. Move then, Later. woman. We want your base, and we're not taking no for an answer. You're gonna be food for the Z's, dipshits! Like the I'm calling again. Come on. <laughs> What are these guys doing? Why is it that as we start evolving and building up as a base, people begin to kill us and become hostile? The most common sense would be, uh, the most common sense thing to do would be to be friendly, but I guess that's too common sense. Goodness gracious, I'm getting up in the sniper tower. Screw this. Come on, recover. Goodness, did we kill all of them? Okay. I'm getting up in the sniper tower. You know what? Sniper support. Oh yes, more creeps. Oh wow. This looks like a good weapon. Be you know what? Sir. Yep, yep, you're dead. Just gotta keep this up a little longer. Yes we do. So much for those. Alright, I'm gonna take this B BML as my team decides to kill all the zombies for me. Get rid of that screamer. I can do that. Oh crap. Ooh, get football tackled. Crap, there's another screamer. This is literally the most intense and biggest horde. I've had to fight, which is kind of why it's an end game top of horde, is what I would assume. Yo, I'm heading out. There we go. Good luck. I'm packing up and heading home. See, not. Goodness. Oh, crap. 
Why would you show up to a community that's doing good and tell them how we're taking your base, period? Like, what kind of stupid crap is that? Ridiculous. The thought of some people in state of decay. Okay, so there's 11 more seconds and then we'll have to clear them out. There's that. Come on, jump over. Come on. Oh my goodness, there's a juggernaut. I don't know about you guys, but I'm starting to like this. You know, honestly, I'm not too surprised. This could be bad news. Oh crap. Get him, get him. Oh run, Levy, run. How you guys handle him? Yeah, he is. Everybody get him. Chop him. There we go. Good job, Charles. Is there another one? Oh crap, there's another one. Yeah, guys, keep shooting them. Y'all have unlimited ammo, I don't. I'm a great leader. Oh my goodness. Come on, get him. Get him. I'll chop at him, don't worry. Ooh, got stabbed in the stomach. Damn, this place is impressive. I can hardly believe how far we've come. I hope everybody else feels as safe and protected as I do. Y'all did amazing work here. I know y'all had your doubts along the way. Listen, I did too. Wow. Wow. You can keep up to 50 survivors for the future communities. Select any that you want to remove. Oh, goodness. All right, current survivor pool. This list shows survivors from the past legacies that you can bring it to future communities. Do this. Wow, this has been, we've beaten the game, guys. It's been an incredible journey, and thank you guys for coming on it with me. And if you guys enjoyed this video, just give it a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next one.